Hey everybody, we have today another uh, video analysis from uh, this uh, recent World Weightlifting Championship, women's 59 kilograms. Winner here was uh, Luo Shifeng from China, winning uh, all three gold medals, snatch, clean and jerk and total. Unfortunately here Kuo his Sing Chun from uh, Taipei was only succeeded 130 clean and jerk and only one uh, silver medal on the clean and jerk. Her snatch pretty low 100 kilograms and uh, probably she was not uh, in a very good shape but definitely she will uh, prepare much better for the next Olympics. So this girl from China, Luo Shifeng, just started to appear on the international stages last year at Worlds. She was succeeded in uh, fourth place with uh, 230 total and now this year on May at the Asian Championship she was succeeded 238 first place and now winning the World Championship, first time uh, winning the World Championship with uh, 243, so slightly she's uh, keep adding uh, weights on the snatch and jerk and total. So let's see her technique, 107, Chinese wrist wraps from uh, leader. All star position, but after that, when she's taking the barbell from the ground, she's adjusting her hips. Let's go a bit uh, frame to frame. So, you see here from uh, setup, she's uh, adjusted a very low hip position. But, uh, like I said, we need to look what is happened when uh, barbell start lifting from the ground. So, we can see here that uh, when she's uh, taking the barbell from the ground. Her hips are in the same level with her knees. Very good start position. Arms very, very straight. Chinese, they are very good at this one. So they are not uh, using early arms. Pushing her knees. A lot here in the sides. I don't know if uh, she's uh, doing this one intentionally from the ground. But uh, if uh, she's doing it uh, not very well. Usually this uh, happen naturally when uh, barbell pass uh, the athlete knees because uh, from there the athletes want to produce uh, power to be more powerful and the hips there are doing an external rotation and uh, when this is happen it's pushing slightly your knees into the sides but it's not uh, very smart to do that intentionally barbell very close here for her she's not uh, rushing to use arms finishing here on tiptoes and very very well on tiptoes and now after barbell pass her uh, hips she's uh, pulling herself under barbell she's using this uh, no fit style she's not uh, jumping too much and uh, when athletes are doing this one they can extend uh, much much more they have uh, this ability normally athletes that are preferring this style are uh, strong athletes so they are not uh, very very powerful they cannot be very explosive and uh, usually their uh, power exercise are uh, quite low from this angle we can see that uh, she is uh, slightly out of balance but uh, she is uh, adjusting very very well her uh, bottom position we can see that here it's uh, entering uh, out of balance but uh, we need to look uh, where she is uh, in the catch position and uh, the catch position is uh, when her arms are straight and uh, we can see that uh, because here with the 107 kilograms the barbell quite heavy she was uh, forcing her to catch very very low below parallel and uh, here when uh, she is below parallel she is in the very very good uh, balance so this is uh, very important and this is a big difference between uh, experienced athletes and uh, intermediate athletes because uh, all the time the experience when they have uh, more weight on the barbell they will try all the time to catch the weight as low as possible and an intermediate athlete when uh, he's adding more weight on the barbell he will try all the time to catch barbell higher so that's why they end up out of balance and they miss most of the times very very good catch here very good mobility low position it's uh, solid here i like uh, her lockout Hands are very good here, keeping the barbell in full hand. Not seeing very well from this uh, angle. Her chin is down and uh, she's uh, looking like it's uh, looking in front with her eyes. So it's uh, pretty good as well from uh, what I'm seeing here. And the recovery here, very, very easy. Very nice attempt for uh, Luo Shifang. 107 here. 
winning uh, with uh, one key G, the snatch over Camila Konotop from uh, Ukraine that uh, she was succeeded the uh, 106. Lor Shifang, uh, she was uh, winning the clean and jerk as well with this uh, 136 uh, kilograms. Six from six, three good attempts on the snatch, three good attempts on the clean and jerk. So perfect competition for uh, Lor Shifang winning all uh, three gold medals. Let's see the clean and jerk here. Nice one. Staying well here in the front rack, split jerk, solid, controlled. Congrats, Shi Fang. Let's see from the start position, like in the snatch, frame to frame. Same setup here, like in the snatch, she's adopting this style when she's staying with the hips lower. But here as well, if we look when she's lifting slightly the barbell from the ground. Her hips are firing up a bit and uh, she is uh, in a very good position where uh, she can use her legs at uh, maximum strength. So this is uh, very important. Arms are good, his are as well. Passing the barbell very, very easy from her knees. Here in power position, she is remaining with uh, arms straight. Not looking like uh, she is uh, shrugging her shoulders. I was seeing this one in the uh, Chinese. Uh, technique that they are not uh, shrugging uh, the shoulders but uh, for Europeans it will be very very hard to do this one because uh, we have uh, longer arms we have a different body proportion and uh, if uh, we not uh, shrug the shoulders we will uh, be forced to use early the arms and uh, that thing it's uh, not uh, very very smart to do so better if you have long arms and you want to be here in the power position with your arms straight it's good if you shrug a bit the shoulders and after that here when barbell is uh, passing your hips to start using arms to pull yourself under barbell. You can see that here in the transition her elbows are above barbell. She is uh, pulling very well, well under barbell. Timing perfect here. Barbell didn't crash on her at all. Finishing the turnover of elbows. Definitely catching very very low here and uh, on the way up. She is uh, trying to produce force and uh, we can see that here her knees are going a bit in and after that when uh, she is uh, passing parallel the knees are going into the sides perfectly and normal when you use uh, right the legs. Front rack it's uh, well performed here. She is uh, keeping the barbell on the shoulders. You can see that uh, in the front rack she is uh, staying with her chin a bit in front. Normally here it's good to look a bit up with your uh, chin to let the barbell uh, space to travel your head. But uh, we can see that uh, Lo Shifeng uh, she has this thing and uh, right on the drive she is uh, starting to look a bit up and uh, let the barbell that space. So this uh, thing it's uh, normal as well to do it if uh, you can control uh, very very well. But uh, you need to make sure that you are not uh, going with your head too much behind because uh, probably then you will uh, not be very very well uh, balanced. It's remaining long enough with front leg on the ground. Moving first back leg here. Footwork it's okay. Uh, she's uh, seeing that uh, her both feet are touching the platform in the same time. Very very hard uh, to say here uh, what was happened because we don't have enough frame. But uh, when you are looking in uh, real time without uh, slow motion, you can see that uh, Luo Shifang has a very good uh, split jerk. I like it. She has uh, here enough distance between her legs. Low back, it's uh, looking uh, that it's straight. That is very, very good. Back leg, it's a bit banded on all toes. And uh, we can see that uh, her lockout, it's uh, solid here. And stable. Recovering first time with the uh, front leg and after that with the back leg. A mastery here for the Luo Shi Feng in the clean and jerk. This video for today is sponsored by my app Super Weightlifting. So if you want to support this channel, you can do by uh, following my programs from uh, Super Weightlifting or uh, if you don't have the possibility, you can do that as well by uh, liking this video, commenting, sharing on your Instagram email or your uh, whatever social platform you are using. And of course, if you want to see more video like this, I have a full playlist with a video analysis where I uh, review it more than uh, 50 athletes, very, very good athletes, snatch clean and jerks. 
and uh, war records and everything else. So if you want to watch up more uh, videos like this one, I highly recommend you to go to that uh, video playlist. This was my video for today. Thanks for watching and uh, we will see you in the next uh, category for sure. Bye bye.